Hi there, uh, let's take a quick look into some of the slideshow and image settings that we have. So first of all, we can select our slide effect and this, this can be either a slide or a fade. Next, uh, we can select our transition speed and this is set in milliseconds, therefore 500 milliseconds is equivalent to five seconds. And then we also have the option of enabling or disabling our autoplay. Now for the autoplay, we also have the option to select our transition speed and then also we have the option to pause the autoplay as soon as we hover over the image. Okay, next uh, let's take a look at the different types of content we can upload to our slideshow. Uh, the most popular option is uploading a regular image and here we have uh, several text areas to work with. So we can add in our title, then we add a description text, and in some cases we also have options like bottom labels, etc. Next we also have the option to change out our elements color. This is basically all of the text uh, color over the slideshow or over that image specifically. And then we can also change out the image overlay color and then also adjust the opacity for that. That way if we have a very bright image we can slightly darken it a little bit and make sure that our text is more visible over that image specifically. Next, uh, we have the option to upload an image, therefore we have a cover image, and then we add in our image video embed code into the following field. All of the following options remain the same. Our third type of slideshow is uploading a video. However, there is a restriction of the video size being a maximum of 10 megabytes, so be sure to upload an appropriate image size. And the way to upload an image, simply click on add file and you drag and drop an image into the following upload area. Next, you select the video size, whether it's full size or original ratio. And then once again, in terms of all of this text content, this remains the same as for the previous two slides. Okay, so this is it in terms of the slideshow and image settings that we have within our theme. Thanks for watching this video and I'll see you guys around later.